welcome back to my channel. If you guys have never seen my videos before, my name is Megan and I am a three-time award-winning makeup artist. So I love everything to do with makeup, skincare, and I love talking to you guys about how to enhance your natural beauty with your red hair. So today I'm going to be talking about my favorite lipstick shades for redheads. This is probably one of the most requested videos. You guys are always commenting on my videos asking what are some lip colors that you can use. So today I'm going to break that down. I have some nude shades. Um, I have some plum shades and then I also have some reds that I think look awesome on redheads. So definitely try these shades out. So if you've been wanting to learn how to do your own makeup, you can learn the secrets to doing gorgeous makeup in my flawless face formula class. Also, as a thank you to everyone who has supported me and my YouTube channel, I have also created a mini class. So this is a ridiculously affordable class. It is called Glowing and Gorgeous, and this is going to teach you how to do glowing and gorgeous makeup on yourself. There's also a skincare section if you've been curious what to do to prep your skin for makeup and what your skincare routine should look like. I have collaborated with a team of estheticians and they have put together the skincare section of that course. So if you guys are curious in checking that out, they will also be linked in the description bar below. All right, without further ado, let's get right into the video. So let me know in the comments below what kind of red you guys have, whether you have a strawberry blonde, whether you have a very vibrant red or you have a copper or an auburn, let me know in the comments below. But all right, getting right into the lipstick colors, why you guys are here. So I'm gonna share a range of lipsticks, lip glosses and lip stains because I know people like using different options. So we're just going to start it off with the one I'm wearing. This is my favorite shade and I tend to reach for this one very, very often. And that is the Hourglass. This is the nude number three. Well, this Hourglass shade is a very peachy nude shade and I love, love, love peaches for redheads. I think that peach tends to flatter us typically a little bit more than do pinks for red hair. So I tend to go for more of a peachy shade and this is a beautiful nude. You guys could wear this if you are just going out and about for every day. Um, because it is understated but you could also wear it with a look like this where it is a little bit more full glam that's the thing i feel like everyone needs a very wearable nude shade and that is this is definitely that i believe that these are a little bit expensive um, they do last and i think that you can also buy the refills instead of buying the full new container i have had this one for a long time and it is still lasting i don't use it every day though i should say i only use it if i'm doing more of like a full done up look now I'm going to mention a lip stain that I really like, and so this one is called Ophelia. This is by Kat Von D. Also a very peachy, nudie shade. I know some people love using lip stains. If you have dry lips, I do not recommend using a lip stain because it's only going to emphasize how dry they are. Or if you live in a dry climate, maybe try a lipstick, like the Hourglass one, instead of a lip stain. So I'm going to put this shade on so you guys can see what this looks like. This is how Ophelia looks like on. I think this is a really nice shade as well. Again, it is a lip stain, so it can be drying, but very beautiful, nice peachy tone, goes well with my rose gold kind of copper eyes that I have going on as well. Okay, then we have this Tarte lip gloss. This one is in the shade Hella. I really like this one. This one is more pinky, but my favorite thing to do with this one is to wear it over top of another color. So like this one here, just do it on in the center a little bit. And you've got a little bit of gloss. Okay, next, and I am a makeup artist, so I do have them in a little palette, but I love Penelope Pink, which is by Charlotte Tilbury. So I just have these depotted. It's this one here. So you can see that I have used the crap out of this shade, but I will show you guys what this one looks like. Love Charlotte Tilbury's lip colors. They are very, very beautiful. Um, the colors just are kind of made for women. Sometimes I find some lip shades, I'm like, I don't know who would look good in that, but this, all of Charlotte Tilbury's, everyone would look good in. This is Penelope Pink. I love this one. I do think it is more peachy as well which you guys know I prefer for redheads, so this is definitely one of my favorite shades. Okay, so next I'm gonna talk about another lip stain, and that is the Too Faced Melted Matte. This one is in the shade Naughty by Nature. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Naughty by Nature. Um, this is a little bit of a deeper shade, so let me show you guys what this one looks like. So this is definitely more of a statement lip. It's kind of like an oxblood red slash brown. I think this looks really nice on redheads because I feel like we look really good with like those earthy tones like coppers and peaches and browns. I feel like that tends to suit us best. So I thought I would throw this in there if you guys are looking for more of like a bold look. Okay, now I feel like I have to talk about a red. I love wearing red lips and I feel like it really stands out when you choose to wear red. 
Also, another nice thing about red lips is you can choose to wear such a simple eye look, maybe just a pair of lashes, simple eyeshadow, and then pop on a red and you look very put together. I'm going to be talking about the Fenty Beauty. I believe this is their universal red, which means it's supposed to look good on everyone and it's called Uncensored. Okay, so I love this red. I think it is very, very wearable as well. Again, maybe for a little bit of a special occasion, unless you want to just be fabulous every day i'm not here to judge you thank you guys so much for watching let me know what your favorite shade in the comments below is out of these shades or if you like a different shade let me know as well i would love to try some new shades if you guys are interested in learning how to do your own makeup don't forget i do have the makeup class the flawless face formula so you can do your makeup confidently so that'll all be linked in the description bar below but thank you guys so much for watching and i hope you have a lovely day